The overall goal of this minimally invasive laparoscopic procedure is to improve assessment of the effects of microbial translocation from the GI tract by collection of mesenteric lymph nodes and liver biopsies at multiple time points while improving animal welfare. This method can aid in answering key questions in the field of HIV biology about immunological consequences of infection and microbial translocation on the mesenteric lymph nodes and liver and the pathology of these tissues. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows for sampling at multiple time points in a study with minimal impact to the animal or to the parameters that are being evaluated. Though this method can provide samples critical to furthering our understanding of HIV, it can also be applied to other models where GI inflammation and microbial translocation are important. Doing the procedure will be Dr. Jeremy Smedley and Dr. Cassie Motes, veterinary surgeons at the Washington National Primate Research Center. After preparing a macaque for the surgery, as indicated in the text protocol, cover it with a sterile fenestrated drape. Next, using a sterile camera drape, tightly cover the digital camera and plug it into the tower. Connect the rigid scope with the camera head. Then attach a sterile light cable to the rigid scope and connect it to the source of light. Finally, mount a sterile insufflation tube on the insufflator. To begin laparoscopy, position a number 15 scalpel blade approximately 1 to 2 centimeters.